Hey and welcome to this tutorial. In this video, I'm showing you how to add a hamburger panel to your pages with the help of JetBlocks plugin. First of all, before starting to add and customize your hamburger panel, you need to go to Elementor Page Builder and create a template that's going to be displayed over here when you click this hamburger button. Now what we need to do is to go to our WordPress dashboard, go to Elementor, My Templates, go and add new template, select the section type and type in the name of your template. Here I'm just going to add some elements to my template. So this is the template that I'm going to go with. Let's save it. Go back to the dashboard. Then I'm going to go ahead and create a new page and edit it with Elementor. And it takes me to an empty page and here on the elements panel I need to scroll down and find JetBlocks section with the JetBlocks widgets. Here I see the hamburger panel widget. I just drop it onto a new section and it shows me this little button. On my left I have the settings for this hamburger panel. First of all I need to choose a template. Let's find the template that we have just created. Here we go. And now when I click on this button, I see my section template appearing on my right. So this little thing is called toggle and you can tweak the alignment of the toggle. Here you have the settings for the panel that appears when you click on the toggle. You have the animation effects, the position and Z index. Also, you can choose the icon for different states of the button. Here you have the styles for both panel and toggle. So you can change the design of both and make them look just the way you want. So now let's go ahead and publish this layout. And have a look at this page on the website. So when I click this button, this panel slides in. You can also add menus to your Elementor template. So it is convenient to use this hamburger panel on mobile devices. All you need to do is just hide this hamburger panel on other devices besides the mobile ones. And you can easily do that in the advanced tab when you go to responsive and hide this hamburger panel on desktop and on tablet. So now you know how to add hamburger panel to your pages with the help of JetBlocks plugin. I hope you liked the video. If you did, hit that like button and subscribe to our channel. Thank you for watching.